Fish Nation. Welcome back, everybody. Have you ever wanted to mute someone's voice in real life like you could on a TV? <laughs> I just turned off Heidi's microphone. <laughs> You're fine now. Go ahead. <laughs> Um, so this is there was a real thing that happened. There was a, a woman in China who was kind of feeling sick to her stomach the night before, and then when she woke up in the morning, she realized that she could not hear her boyfriend's voice at all. Because they got married the night before. <laughs> Once you get married, suddenly you don't hear the man's voice. Uh, she went to the doctor, of course, as you would, and she was diagnosed with RSHL, which stands for Reverse Slope Hearing Loss, which is a condition where someone can't hear low-frequency sounds. But um, this um, is selective, so it's just low frequency. Yeah. And since guys have lower voices like this, she can't pick up on that low that r- low rumble. So now her boyfriend has a, honey, <laughs> honey, would you like to maybe have sex with me now? <laughs> and she's probably still going, I still Woohoo! <laughs> I'll see this is Doubtfire, a way to yeah, communicate with just her. Just to get his point across. Yeah. I guess doctors think they may have a cure for her so she can hear her boyfriend or husband's voice again, uh-huh. but she hasn't returned their calls. <laughs> Does she have any idea what's wrong with her? Because she, when she went to the doctor, I mean, she's probably talking to a man if she's going to a good one. I don't hear anything. Is somebody talking? Is somebody, oh! Somebody. I don't, somebody. <laughs> <laughs> you can hear me. 